Hey, hey guys, it's me, Charlene Mars. Welcome to my channel. I hope you guys are enjoying this beautiful day. What? But then again, blah, blah, I don't know how the weather's gonna blah, be blah, when you watch blah, this, because I still have blah, to edit blah, this video blah, and blah, 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 yeah. Anyways, I hope you guys are enjoying ya day. Okay? Okay, today's video, I was super excited to film. I used Huda Beauty's Amethyst, Amethyst, Amethyst? Amethyst, Amethyst. Amethyst. Amethyst, whatever, Obsession palette. Oh, look how cute. Eee, I was so excited when these released. I was like, I need to get all the colors. <sighs> so yeah, I love this little thing. It's like so cute. If you want to learn how I created this beautiful purple look, please keep watching. All right, guys, to start off, I'm going to apply some tape on my eye. This is going to make sure that I have a precise line when I'm blending all the shadows in. So, go here. And apply that there. When I'm applying the tape, I like to make sure it's in an angle that aligns to my eyebrow. I'm now going to apply Urban Decay's Primer Potion all over my eyelid, and I'll be blending this in using a small concealer brush. With my Morphe M433, I'm going to pick up this shade here and use it as my transition shade. Remember guys, a little goes a long way. It's always better to pick up less shadow and just work your way up because it's obviously harder to blend if you get shadow crazy and pick up a shitload of shadow with your brush. With my Morphe G18, I'm just going to blend a little of that nice pink shade right on the edges this is going to give it a nice diffused look with my morphe m506 i'm going to apply this shade directly on my crease as you can see by applying this darker shade i'm giving my eye more depth and definition it gives it more of a hollow look which is great when we're cutting the crease to create even more dimension, I'm going to use my Sigma E47 and pick up this dark plum shade and apply it directly on my crease. I'm also going to bring that shade in towards the outer corner of my eyelid. To cut my crease, I'll be using Tarte Shape Tape Concealer in the shade Light Sand, and I'll also be using my handy dandy Sigma E62. So I'll just go ahead and tap the concealer right on my crease. And just follow the shape. You see? And then I just blend the concealer into my eyelid. With my Morphe M124, I'm going to pick up this shade here and apply it directly on my eyelid. So basically any place where I cut my crease is where I'm going to put this shade in. Using my Morphe M41, I'm going to pick up this plum shade again and I'll be applying it right on the outer corner of my eyelid. I'm now going to pick up NYX's Liquid Crystal Body Liner in this shade Gunmetal and I'll be tracing my cut crease. Now you're going to grab a fan, a book, a paper, whatever, and you're just going to fan your eyes. This will ensure that the liquid glitter dries without you know, sticking on everywhere and creating a hot mess. For lashes, I'll be applying Huda Beauty's Fox Mink Lashes in the style Farah. Alright guys, so now that my eyelashes are on, I'm going to create an extremely small wing. For this, I'll be using Kat Von D's Tattoo Liner. Alright guys, so I'm going to just create a very thin line. Fill that in. Wing it a little bit. And 
and voila. So I'm just going to take this tape off and bam, look at that. Ooh, sexy. Oh, yes. All right, guys, so we're pretty much done. We just have to apply a little shadow on our lower lash line. So before I get to that, let me put on my face. I'm back. With my Morphe M408, I'm going to apply this shade on my lower lash line. I'm now going to apply Marc Jacobs Velvet Nior Major Volume Mascara. For lipstick, I'll be using Huda Beauty's Liquid Matte Lipstick in the shade Muse. Once the lipstick is dry, I'm going to top off my lips with Fenty Beauty's Lip Gloss Topper from the Summer Days Collection and the shade is ready to mingle. Lastly, to set my face, I'm going to apply Tatcha Luminous Dewy Skin Mist. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you liked it, please give it a big thumbs up. And if you haven't already, subscribe to my channel, please. Love you.